everybody. All right, let me share this with my group. Okay, where am I? I'm trying to find my life. Going live. Let's refresh my page. So, if you are watching this replay, my name is Sophia Pacific Reis, and I'm a, a visibility GPS strategy coach for coaches, and uh, I'm from IncreaseSocialReach.com. Okay, so today what I'm going to talk about is. Um, to uh, just a reminder that, uh, that I've got a, a workshop coming up next next week, next Monday, which is the Master Your Media Marathon, and um, so you need to register if you want to take part of it. But today I'm going to talk about one of the things I'm going to present next week, which is uh, one rookie mistake that you are doing with your social media marketing and how to avoid it okay so let me just um share this live with my group so they can come in and participate so it's very easy i'm on my mobile here but um i can share it from my computer so i'm just going to share to my group And I'm also going to share to the event I've got going. I've got the link on the top, I think. If not, then I'll put it on the comments below when the video finishes. Um, I'm going to share with the event page. So you can do that. You just share it and you choose event on it. Cool. So... One rookie mistake, I'm going to talk about more mistakes next week, but today I just wanted to leave you thinking about this, okay, just one rookie mistake that you're doing with your social media marketing when you first start it. Um, and, you know, we all done it, I've done it, <laughs> so you're not alone on this one. And the thing is, right, when you start, um, when you start going out there, in your social media channels and being visible and showing up what you do, what you love to do. Um, you really need to be, um, to focus on, on finding your audience, okay? And that's the main thing really. Um, one of the things that I did in the beginning is that I really needed to know where my audience was hanging out so I could be there for them, okay? Um, what I haven't done though, was, um, have my mindset completely clear around my niche and who I want to target, which is changed now. I'm completely clear and focused on who I want to target, but this is just a little reminder to tell you, right, before you start going on social media and, you know, telling everybody what you do and, um, your products, your services and everything else and doing social selling, the first thing that you need to do is to find your ideal audience, okay? And for that, you really need to know who your audience is, okay? So there are a few exercises that you can do to find your ideal audience and to be clear on who you are targeting. So one of the rookie mistakes that everybody does, makes, is... Um, to be on every single social media platform. Um, I've done it, like I said, you know, um, I've done it in the beginning, but now I focus on um, two to three max, okay? And one, my favorite, everybody has a favorite, my favorite is Facebook. Um, my favorite is Facebook because it's where my... Um, tribe my audience is hanging out um, I'm part of groups of coaches and so I'm a visibility coach for coaches so I'm within all those groups for coaches so what I want to say is um, 
just you need to really be very clear of what you want to achieve with with each social media platform okay because they're all different and they all do different things and the way you communicate on facebook is different from the way you communicate on twitter it's different from the way you communicate on linkedin and on pinterest okay so you need to be very very clear on the goals that you want to achieve with your platforms um because joining too many platforms i've got my notes here so <laughs> joining too many platforms um it's a de desperate act really and you can get overwhelmed pretty quick and to be honest with you what once you start getting overwhelmed really quick because you're on all this social media platforms what happens is you will stop um you know engaging and communicating with your audience um so like i said the, one way to avoid it is to choose a favorite first of all to set your goals for uh, what you want to achieve with social media and then depending on those goals is where you should be hanging out and um, also find where your audience is it might not be on Facebook it might not be on Twitter so you need to do some research to actually know where your audience is hanging out and then um, just focus on one to two platforms at a time because otherwise the overwhelm will set in and you will you will give up basically you'll give up because it's too much conversation and you haven't got no control over it okay so um so basically what you need to do is um so be very clear on your niche first be very clear on a niche because once you start being clear on your niche you can better craft your message content message to that specific niche so you need to be very clear on your niche and you have to be very clear on who you target. You might just um, want to target um, women um, from 30 to 40. Um, specific characteristics, where is, where is those women hanging out? Um, so you have to really create like a sort of an avatar in, you, in your head or even, you know, if you want you can draw it physically draw it the avatar that ideal woman that you want to work with and be very very clear and the more you tune in to that um that audience that woman the more you tune in the more you know what's her pain points what exactly she wants not needs she wants um I say not needs because of what you think you she needs might not be what she actually needs. So you know, I've spent um, I've spent a long time, over almost over a year or two, really listening into conversations. Um, you know, go to groups and really tune in to other people. Um, engage start conversations and start knowing what they actually want and then when you're specific on that you can create content around it content that you're going to use on your social media platforms and again if you are in too many too many uh platforms and you don't have a relevant content strategy around it um, they will soon leave the platform because they see that there's no consistency in your message. So, again, <laughs> rookie mistake number one, being on too many platforms. So basically, being on too many platforms and being nowhere because you can't physically be on all of them without a strategy, without a plan. Um so that was just a little snippet of what I'm going to uh, present next week in my uh, Master Your Media Marathon um, workshop. It's a free workshop for those that need um, some guidance um, around uh, social media marketing and what to do. So um, I've put the link on the top, I think. So if you are interested, please register 
to receive the emails and um, to get all the information details that will be on the email and what's going to happen, how we're going to do this, but we're going to keep it very, very, very simple because I like it simple. K-I-S-S. -S. <laughs> so I'll speak to you very, very soon. Have a lovely, lovely weekend. And um, if you have any questions whatsoever, just pop them in the comments and I'll come back to you as soon as possible. Bye.